Hello friends, hola amigos. Today I'm going to show you how to update your connect system and especially the map data. Welcome to this new video. So guys, this is the newest connect edition which doesn't have an SD card slot anymore so the updates are all going uh, online so in order to update you go to the settings and there we can go to the system update and there I can see map update so you can do two things you can update by Wi-Fi or you can update by a USB device so the update can take quite some long time and you have to let the motor running. So I'm going to update by USB device. That means that you prepare an USB stick in the car that you take inside to download the updates, uh, the map data to the USB, USB stick. So here's my USB stick that we're going to put in the USB port of the car. There we go, and we click on USB device. So save map information on the USB device, press start. Okay, so our USB stick is ready to go inside and use the map update tool. I already have downloaded and installed the Nissan map update tool. It's a one time process. I will show you just what happens if you plug the USB stick in. So guys, I'm back in the car. Um, I did my update as you saw on the video. Um, here is the SD card. You have uh, to use a USB stick uh, with minimum 32 gigs and formatted in FAT32. So we're going to plug it in. So you can see it generates automatically a pop-up there you go with all the information um, so you can see it goes from update 2 to update 4 it is 15 gigs and it will take about 51 minutes to update important you may not shut down the the, the car uh, when you update so I'm going to perform this update while doing a drive uh, it, useless to leave the car uh, turning for 51 minutes without going nowhere so I will let it do its job and I will come back to you later so I think it is uh, a little bit more than 20 minutes later now I had a lot of different screens popping up uh, with several minutes, download has started, download completed, next download, etc. You almost would think that it um, is bugged and uh, it doesn't achieve to uh, complete the, the download normally. But after a while, the update uh, is completed as you can see here. And now we confirm and everything works. So after the update was correctly installed, I parked the car for some time. And when I restart the car, the connect system rebooted several times and only after i think uh, seven or eight reboots i uh, was able to use the connect system again some settings were lost after this update quite uh, odd i had to reset the um, clock to a 24 hour modus and um, my home screen has changed so i have to reset my widgets 
So, up to you if you're going to use this update um, by USB stick. Uh, personally, I don't think I'm going to use this very much because I uh, don't use the TomTom -tom anyway. I use Waze or uh, Apple Maps. But I will do it from time to time, especially at the end of the five year period where you can update the map data for free. So I hope you like this video. Uh, please share and subscribe and I see you in the next one. Bye bye.